we always bring this to the attention of NCDC or to the media, but nothing has ever been done about this. So we've almost all these houses along the street have been, have, have been badly affected in a lot of ways. Cars, vehicles have been damaged because when the flood comes, the flood goes over the vehicles. The vehicles are underwater and a lot of our houses, they are out for rentals. They have um, downstairs. Downstairs, the flood covers the bottom areas of the house. And um, we've had um, cases where our, the elderly people on this street too have been really badly affected too medically, and they're still affected to this date. Now, they failed to put bigger culvert, and as a result, water is building up, affecting all these properties. Since the construction started, that has happened. So there is a negligent act. So the relevant authorities will be responsible for all losses suffered. For example, the vehicle engines these have been seized. The property value has been undermined. For example, my client has started developing this land so that he can put it up for rent. But nobody would like to come and stay here when this risk, risk is uh, imposed uh, upon his property. And I think the same story will be told throughout all the residents here. So that is a failure to the government. It, uh, I mean, the relevant authorities, including NCD, needs to realize that the, as long as this culvert problem is not rectified, the property value of these residents here has been diminished.